Feast of St. John, Apostle and Evangelist. Then the other disciple also went in, the one who had arrived at the tomb first, and he saw and believed. The proximity of today's feast to the celebration of the Lord's birth can be attributed to St. John's closeness to the heart of Jesus' Master. He who reclined at his Master's side and rested his head on his bosom, as in the picture of the Last Supper, has surely learned a lot from him. Such is indeed an icon of faithful listening and obedience. In today's Gospel, this beloved disciple entered the tomb after Peter. He saw and believed. Eventually, he dedicated his life to testify to all that others may also believe and follow Jesus' way of love. Let us pray. God our Father, who through St. John has revealed heavenly secrets, grant us the grace to understand all that he reveals to us. Jesus, Master, the way, the truth, and the life, have mercy on us. Amen.